Today we're building a remote control shoe. Why? Why not? This might be one of the simplest but most fun builds we've ever done. Dig into your closet and find an old shoe. Then raid that old toy box and snatch a small remote control car up. The first step is to take the RC car apart and make sure it'll fit inside the shoe. This one was a bit deceiving, as it only had 4 screws that were showing, but ended up having 12 inside. Once I finally got them out, we're down to the bare bones of a fully functional RC machine, and it's ready for a new home, inside a shoe. Carving out the shoe itself was the most difficult part of this modification. I first attempted to cut directly into the sole, but found that the material was just too tough. Next, I tried breaking out the rotary tool. Again, no luck. After examining the inside of the shoe, it became clear that there was a small seam lining the bottom of the sole. We finally found the weakness. Time to exploit it. So I cut right through it like butter. Once it was sliced, I pulled the two pieces apart, leaving me with a nice new body for the RC car. But now the RC car needs to be secured inside without any worry of it falling apart on rough terrain. After going back and forth, I decided to use super glue as the bonding agent. So I lined the inside of the shoe with it and then compressed them directly onto the center of the RC car. After holding it together for about 5 minutes and letting it fully bond, we had ourselves a fully operational shoe car. Let's take it out for a spin. Dogs love these things. I also took it out on the street to confuse the locals. All in all, a fun little mod to raise eyebrows or make people think you're crazy. If you want the remote control shoe we built here, give it a like and let me know in the comments. I'll send it to one of you. A huge thanks to Sprint for supporting our project. You can check out some of their awesome videos below and learn something new. We'll see you next time.